Right, this is one of my favourite water inventions, Roman, um, and it uses the tube just like in the sort of piston bugger wheel that we showed earlier, except it's a lot cleverer this one. And I've recreated this from drawings from um, an original lead uh, construction pump that was found within the, the old Roman city walls in London. So I was absolutely amazed when I saw the plans of this and I've tried to make an, another one. It was a bit more sophisticated than that because it had twin action pistons rather than just the humble one piston that this one has. So as you can see there's sort of a lever arrangement. So there's the handle. You'd probably recognise that from a, an old sort of film where somebody would be pumping water from a well. Well it is pretty similar to that. And then um, I've attached a tube to it so the idea is the pump brings water up from down below up into the cylinder but then pumps it along pipes and of course the Romans could make lead pipes. So let's have a go at that then. In the water. So remember the whole idea is we're raising water from a low level to a high level continuously so that it can be used. You'll not believe what this was used for, but you may get a clue when it starts operating. Here we go. So what do you think it might have been? <laughs> oh, <laughs> too, too far. <laughs> well, the idea was it could have been a, a fire hose. Could have been an old Roman fire hose, so I thought I'd give it a try. Here we go. Right then, Let's see, couldn't get it to work. So there's the fire hose attachment there. So Roman fire fire engines, can you imagine that? It's quite amazing, really. Water inventions are very messy. <laughs> <laughs>